He's coming! He's coming! And I can't get away. He runs faster than I do. No, he's not going to give up. He's literally... Oh, it's a dead end again! No! Hello YouTube and welcome back to another video on Labyrinthine. I hope you're doing really well. I'm going to show you yet another brand new map, this time the Bamboo Forest from Japan. This one is really quite interesting. You have to find incense sticks and burn them in order to open up the exit. It is a mixture of forest paths and Japanese themed buildings. It's another one that I had on the public test server but I wasn't able to try it out. So now I'm going to go in and do it. But I also actually want to confirm one more thing before I go in about the backpack and how items in here worked. I'd finally figured it out. There I was assuming that when you bought something from the shop like uh, a Johnny Honk's maze map that it, and you put it into your inventory like this, I'm going to do that, I'm going to my loadout and drag it into here, that I would automatically find it on my person, like as if it was one of the glow sticks or the compass, it was another option would be the map, but instead what actually happens is the backpack will be found at the start of the map and your items that you've dragged in there will be available for you to pick up outside that map. Who knew? But they have confirmed this with the launch of the live version that has just gone out. Anyway, let's go on in straight into the bamboo maps and I'll see you in game. Right, let's get that torch on and let's get the green glow sticks going. So I've got a bit of a new system now, kind of adapted from my friend Tom, who I've played... What? Look at that, look at that. Whoa, 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 whoa. That was Wicker Man, wasn't it? That was Wicker Man. I think that's Wicker Man. Yeah, he won't come back to the start, that's fine. Oh yeah, creaking, that's Wicker Man. So, here is my thing. Okay, so green is just my path through the map this time. Red is to mark a safe room. Blue is to mark a dead end. And pink is to mark an objective. And then a mixture of all four to mark the junction to the exit. And you know what, that actually works out an absolute treat. So much better than just using a different colour for each life. So here we go, let's go down here and see what we can find. Oh, it's a dead end. So, what I do is I'll just stick three blue here. Uh, maybe one would just suffice, but blue is easy to see. And that way, if I'm ever being chased by a monster, I know that way is definitely going to be a dead end and I will get myself killed. Ooh, building. This is what I mean about a mixture of, um, of buildings and, um, and forest path. It's different to the, to the cornfield, which I find is... Uh, it's somewhat lacking. I find it really uninteresting. Oh, this is probably where we insert the incense sticks to get out. That looks probably the exit. Okay, that's great. Yeah, the cornfields map I thought I was really going to like. Given that I love the bit in the chapter 2 map where you go out into a giant field. There he goes. There he goes. You can't outrun the Wicker Man as far as I know, but you need to be near a source of fire for him to leave you alone. That's why I'm just waiting for him to go past. But yeah, it's kind of just really very samey pathways the cornfields it does ha what how did he how i'm a dead person nothing i can do nothing i could do there you go with command you can get me i don't know how he actually saw me i was already down a different path at that point i think that's really that's really harsh what kind of what kind of see-through laser vision has he got Okay, yeah, so norm let's get let's get the torch out. That's a really bad start, isn't it? A really bad start. Because this is a small easy map, but uh Wicker Man is not I've not had too many dealings with the Wicker Man. We're down there down here now. It looks like a giant rock. But generally I find he is actually one of the trickier difficulty monsters. I'm assuming there is only one of him on this map. Is that is that a flame? Here we go. Does this count as a flame? Is that gonna Deter the Wicker Man. Let's just check down here. It says a dead end. I don't know if it is a dead end or not. Uh, we can, we can. No, this is going straight back to another building. Is that another building? It is another building. Oh, good. What's in here? Oh, hey, incense stick. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> so yeah, new music as well. I love the artwork. I love the artwork. Very, very different to the um, melancholy kind of sound of the. Um, the original safer music. Is he going to come around this corner? He is. So we're going to quickly just peg it into here. Yeah, we're safe in here. He won't come in here. He won't come in here. You go away. You go away, Wicker Man. Oh god, he is getting close, isn't he? I think they do have sensors in their back. 
so that you can't just literally hug, hug, hug them as they run around the maze. He's coming back. Oh, he's going the other way. That's all good. You go that way. No, he's walking parallel to me there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go all the way back down this way, and I'll go back towards where I was, where I found the exit room. I should actually mark that that as um, as pink, so that we know that is an objective. That's an objective I need to reach. Oh no, I don't. No, no. I should give it the um, the full four colours, shouldn't I? Here we go. So that, that. And then that, and that way, hopefully, from a distance, I'll be able to see that is uh, absolutely the way I to go. So we need four more incense sticks at this point. Um, not fancying my chances with Wicker Man. He is an absolute pain in the backside, and I got a funny feeling that those candles are not going to stop him. <laughs> they just don't. Like in Chapter Three, if you stand by an enormous bonfire, he'll leave you alone. Obviously, he's made of wood, so he's scared of fire. I get the feeling a tiny little candle is not going to be enough. Like that just doesn't feel like enough to uh, to stop him. Oh, there's another house here. Let's. Uh... I think that's a house. Is that a house? Oh my giddy aunt! Here he comes. We're dead. We're dead. Right, let's go put this to the test. We'll put this to the test. If we can get there in time. Here we go. Is this going to stop him? Candle. No, I don't think it will. I don't really don't think it will. He's coming. He's coming, and I can't get away. He runs faster than I do. No, he's not going to give up. He's literally... Oh, it's a dead end again. No, Wicker Man, no. Oh, you know what I didn't do? You know what I didn't do? I didn't actually show you the bag. I didn't show you the bag. Here it is. There, look. Look, there's the map. There's the map. If I pick it up, uh, it's now in my inventory. Here, look. Here's the map. But I can barely see it. And I guess it only pre-populates once you run around w with it. So as we run around, what does it do? Is it going to start to... Oh, look, look, there it is. It's it's starting to pre-populate the map. But it's really hard to see. And I don't know how valuable it is. But there you go. <laughs> there it is. He's already coming. I anticipate I'm going to be a dead man very soon. This is actually a lethal map. Lots of dead ends so far. Lots of straight paths and then dead ends. Here we go. It looks like we've been this way before. I think that, oh, there we go. That was that house. We found one of the incense sticks. Let's go this way. Well, now we know these absolutely don't work and they're just decorative. Where are the bonfires in which we can stop him? I probably should have marked these with blue. Keep going. Yeah, look, so many dead ends. Well, I should be doing this. At least I know I've, I've looked down them that way. Right, we'll carry on going this way. And I bet that's another dead end. Yeah, so many dead ends. So many dead ends. Oops, I dropped a pink. That's going to confuse me, isn't it? Right, here we go. I want to see what that little hut was where we bumped into Wicker Man. It looked like it looked like some kind of sort of objective. That looks like a, that looks really important that way, but I've got to just keep I want to circle around it first. Because I'm not quite sure where he is. Check in here just in case this is a uh, another dead end. I haven't even got time to mark it. I think he's actually coming following the same path that I've taken, which is which is not good. It's like he knows where I am. No, he sounds directly opposite me now. What if there's two? It's too open. It's a puzzle. It's a puzzle. It's a it's a puzzle thing. Let's just let's just check everywhere else until we get to that that puzzle. Oh, it's going to another dead end. It's going to have um, one of the incense sticks in there. There doesn't appear to be any way. Oh god, he's there. He's there. He's right there. He was. Ooh, 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 ooh. Safe room. Safe room. Safe room. Be a safe room. Ooh, three incense sticks. That means the last one is going to be in that puzzle. The last one is going to be in that puzzle. Okay, right. And we know where the exit is. And we can do this. Two lives left. We can do this. We can do this. Because I need to leg it to that room. If he sees me, I'm going to have to leg it back that way. Oh, it's this one. It's it's go as quickly as you can. But you run like an absolute, I don't know what, in, in this one. 
Look, I'm never going to make it to the other side in time. Oh, I did. Uh, this one? No, I got it wrong. Run. <laughs> Run, he's there. I will come back. I will come back to that one. I just need to make sure. See where he goes. You keep walking. Keep walking. That one. Oh, God. God! Damn, I had one more to go. Oh, somehow I've de aggroed him. No, I haven't. He's on his way. So close. <gasps> you can't get me. You can't get me. Yeah, yeah. You're scared of these rooms. Why is he scared of these rooms? One furthest away. Good, good, good. We've done it. We've done it. Right, now. We've got to go back exactly the way. The wicker man. Unless, unless I go back around this way and try and hit the, the exit over there in that direction. If I can go back this way and turn left, maybe I'll be okay. I'll keep my eyes and ears open. Down there. That's just so far, so good. Should we check that Johnny Honks map again? See what, how it looks now. See? See? Not very useful. Is it only populating while it's in my hand? That is no good. I can't see anything. But there's the exit. I can see it up ahead where I marked the glow sticks. Just got to hope we can make it there to the right without the Wicker Man heading us off down one of these side passages. Okay. I think we're good. I think we're good. I assume we just put them all in the pot here and that's it. I literally assume that is it. It's as simple as that. Yes, it is as simple as that. Oh, fantastic. Let's go. That's another map done. Another map done. Shame there was no uh, cosmetics on that one. Occasionally you can get cosmetics on the uh, on the maps that without um, without the, the the blue wax seal, but uh, only a tiny amount of tickets, tiny amount of XP. But you know, it's okay. That's okay. What did we get in its place? We got two now crypts maps. What medium, normal, three, medium, normal, four. So we we starting to get medium maps. I did have a hard long. <laughs> <clears throat> A harder map the other day and uh, managed to do that, but it was only the witch. The witch I find the easiest. It did give me this cosmetic, however, which is good. It's gone now. I've taken it off. But we got a little ghosty. I think it's a picture of Clarice the ghost on there, which is cool. Which is cool. It's another beanie. Anyway, great stuff. So there you have it. That is the new bamboo map and the dreaded wicker man. I didn't get the Oni monster, which is the monster that is tied to that map. That would be great to be able to see that at some point. But, you know, we are still on the easy level map at this stage. So just the trenches, which is a new one I still have to show you at this point. I'll hopefully try and get something of that on my channel soon. But if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, please give it a thumbs down. But why not consider subscribing for more horror shenanigans? Till next time, please stay safe. Bye-bye.